What's up, Outsiders? We're back in the Adirondacks to tackle a couple more winter high peaks. Today, we're gonna tackle Giant and Rocky Peak Ridge. Well, we're starting out with a cool morning. It's a minus two degrees. Uh, it's supposed to warm up a little bit. We finally got some clear skies. It's a nice sunrise. We're getting some nice colors. We're gonna head up to uh, almost climb all the way to the top of Giant head over to Rocky Peak Ridge, and then finish on Giant. I'm really looking forward to today. I have always thought Giant would be an awesome summit in the winter, and uh, I'm excited to get a couple more winter high peaks under my belt. So we're gonna get our snowshoes on and get on the trail. Ready to roll? All set. All right, brother. Ready to rock. A little bit of snowpack. So we're at the first little lookout here. We got Chapel Pond below us. We climbed about 700 feet in like a half a mile. Giant is definitely a stair stepper. I think total elevation gain is like 3,000 feet in like three miles. So it's, it's a bit of an effort, but it's definitely worth it with all these overlooks as you come up. Always looking behind you, just beautiful. So we're about a mile in. We've reached the junction of the Giant Ridge Trail and the Nubble. Never been to the Nubble. Supposed to be some nice views. About a thousand feet of elevation gain so far. Another, Feel it. Another couple thousand to go. The great thing about Giant is there's all these cool overlooks and slides that as you get higher and higher, you get that view of Chapel Pond, then you get the view of the wash bowl. And switchbacks, thank God for switchbacks. Yeah, there's surprisingly there's some switchbacks on this trail that you usually don't get in the Adirondacks. Feel good, skies are still great. Perfect day to be out here hiking. So on hikes like this, it's kind of weird with it being like single digits. You're hot and cold at the same time. Your body's generating a lot of heat, but my, my head is sweaty, but my face is frigid. My hands are good, but my toes are cold, so kind of a weird sensation being hot and cold at the same time. Layering is so important. Amazing. Yeah, I think uh, sun's coming up. I'm gonna actually have to put sunglasses on, I think. And I think that's Rocky Peak Ridge right there. So, unfortunately, we gotta go down to go back up. Amazing, though. At the junction of Rocky Peak and Giant. Giant's only a few hundred yards right up that way, but I think we're gonna head over to Rocky Peak and do the work first. I tell you, it is no wind and just beautiful skies. What a beautiful day to be in the high peaks. 
Amazing. Can't wait to get over to Rocky Peak. Like I said, the only bad part about this hike is we basically climbed to the top of Giant. We're at uh, 4580 right now. I think Giant's like 46 something. So now we gotta go down that call and up to Rocky Peak. It's worth it though. Some beautiful views on Rocky Peak. So I bet you never thought you'd be doing this. No, I was just saying like two years ago, never in my wildest dreams would I be thinking I'd be up here. And it's, it's worth it. I'm so glad you convinced me and brought me. Yeah, winter, winter 46ers are awesome. Unpredictable, but awesome, as you can tell. I mean, highly recommend it. Yesterday kind of sucked. Didn't really get any views. Didn't get any views on Tabletop or Phelps a couple days ago. And today, it makes it all worth it. But we got to get moving. I'm cold. <laughs> Rocky Peak there, I believe, Rocky Peak Ridge. So we gotta go down a little bit and over to it. But yeah, this, this is definitely one of the nicest overlooks here. Always amazes me when you can see the peak like that. Looks like you gotta go so far to go back up to it. It's a lot of effort there, but it doesn't take you as long as you think. But it's so cool when you can see kind of where you're going, either from a false summit or an overlook like this. Oh, no sweat. Nice job. views up here. Giants right there. Not too windy. <laughs> a little bit chilly. Whew. It's such a cool summit. Back to the Rocky Peak Giant Junction. So how's it feel climbing Giant twice, basically? Well, thighs hurt, but it's uh, nice to see it from both sides. We're gonna head up to Giant. It's not too far from this junction. Enjoy the summit. It's still a beautiful day. Some view of white face. It's awesome being up here. So Eric was uh, indoctrinated into the tradition yesterday, so he knows the routine now for our customary shot. Not not the quite the wind we had yesterday. Nostroya. Salante. Cheers. Go well done, my friend. Thank you. Winter high peak number four, right? <sighs> Nicely done. Many more to come. Many more. As long as I can walk. That's true. It's not the number, it's the experience. This is amazing up here today. 
not a whole lot of wind can spend some time when you can <laughs> actually take it in not just get to the summit and be so cold and frozen you want to turn around nice get some pictures it's gonna be a quick ride down a lot of glissading hopefully and uh, then a long ride back Food but change but it's been a very successful trip this is this was a spectacular day what are you guys doing next week <laughs> exactly at the kiosk Eric signing us out and uh, it was a really fast ride down we had some really fun glissades and uh, I tell you after the four days or four high peaks that I did the previous two days with being socked in and gray skies you're really really thankful for bluebird days like this I mean very little wind the Sun is shining temperatures were a little cool to start but uh, really didn't affect us too much this is I think number 29 and 30 for winter high peaks for me I got a little ways to go I got some hard ones left Eric got the bug for high peaks this summer and uh, I think he's got the bug for uh, winter high peaks it started a new challenge uh, probably gonna have to finish it yep so a great day in the mountains Hope you like this video if you did click that like button if you want to see other outdoor adventures gear how to's no if you want to see other outdoor adventures gear reviews how to's subscribe to my channel that's it for now we'll see you outside and a boy mm -hmm.